So we have arrived in Florida. We are making our stop at Target, a Super Target at that. Never been to a Super Target. So let's go in and see what we can find. Just like back at home, we're gonna start off in the wrestling aisle and it looks like we are already finding some clearance AEW. Check this out. The Adam Cole Target exclusive for $10. We end up grabbing that. So our kind of AEW is back here. If there's anything that we need or not. WWE, New Undertaker, right? Yeah. Kind of out of date with what's new because I haven't really been hunting at these stores in a while. Kind of deals with that up there. 1954 and 1609. Hmm. There's another Adam Cole. Put him back up there. Um, damn, it's a really nice box, too. Nice and clean, shiny. I'm sure I could find this up my way. But then again, who knows? I barely found the uh, Sammy Guevara. I never found the Darby Allen. So I think for $10 on clearance, we'll go ahead and grab the Adam Cole. Over here in Star Wars, it looks like this is new also. This is the Paz Vizsla. Uh, if I can get him down. What's this sign? 50% off of... No, it's... So AEW figures are buy one, get one half off. So I wonder if that counts for for just any of them because I still need the uh, Supreme Britt Baker. But I also have a buddy that wanted the Adam Cole. So we might end up grabbing both of them if the deal applies for those. I'll have to check on that, but this pet is Vizsla. It's pretty cool. Hmm. That is a really nice figure. Put him back up there. Let's grab both these Adam Coles for now. Cause like I said, I got a buddy that wants one. He doesn't really care about the box. So if that is the deal, 10 bucks, five bucks, I'll take that. This is new. This is the Luke and Grogu set. I want the Luke from Mandalorian. I don't want this one though. I want the one uh, where he comes in and obliterates all of the dark troopers. That's like the best scene of season two. What did we miss anyway? Vintage Boba Fett was 1469. 40th Return of the Jedi. All Lando, of course, no surprise there. I'm guessing the Indiana Jones figures were around here. Which I've never even seen any of those at my targets up in New Jersey. Newer Turtles stuff, nasty figures. Storage shell Leonardo. Still got the uh, elite figures hanging around. So aside from the Leo, there's no other classic release turtles. Just a lot of the newer figures, the Leonardo, the Rocksteady, the Michelangelo, some of the mutating Leos. I haven't, I don't think I've seen these yet. They're pretty cool. Target exclusive, I never knew that. We got these sets down here. Uh, coming on down, oh, check that out. That's the, uh, the new sewer layer play set. 80 bucks, that's not bad if uh, if you guys are looking for that. There are three of them back there um, at this Target. So yeah, let me check out this box art. This is really nice, all the colors pop on it. I mean, I don't need it, I'm not doing this line at all. I know a few people have been looking. So if you are in the Orlando area, this Target, um, I forget the location of this Target. I will uh, show that in a second here when I remember the name but yeah there you go it's here if you need it it looks like over here in the Marvel and DC section we do have some new stuff some new Dungeons and Dragons figures this is Eric and Sheila uh, she actually was just at RetroCon so if you guys went to RetroCon you probably met her we have Presto and it looks like that's it so Eric Sheila and Presto these figures look good I wonder if they've uh, made improvements from the last ones. This is new from the X-Men 97 series. The X-Team Jet and Storm. It's a nice set. Wolverine Claws. Magneto Helmet from X-Men. From the Titan Hero series, they're doing some of the figures as well. So they got the Wolverine 
and looks like that's it. So three Wolverines. Are they planning on doing anybody else? I'm assuming we're going to get all these characters. So this is your thing also. I guess check your targets. That should be showing up. This Battle Group, $13.99. Another Titan hero. Big figure, it looks like. Up here we have some more clearance. We have some more Cobra Kai and Power Rangers. This is um, the morphed uh, Miguel Diaz. It's the Red Eagle Ranger. Looks like the Miz, if you ask me, but it's pretty cool. It's $13.99. If I was actually collecting that uh, line, I probably would, would grab that. Um, another one, $13.99 for the Scalaputty. Actually, yeah, okay, so they had Johnny Lawrence, he was $13.99, and then the Skeleputty is $13.99. So, so they're getting ready to clear those out. So again, if you guys need those, check your stores. What the hell is this? Is this something I missed? Oh, dude, look at that. Whoa, I didn't even know this was coming out. See, I haven't really been paying attention to the newer toys, so I probably missed this. Look at that freaking box, man. Like, just as a display piece, that is really nice. Hmm, $22.99 on that. So you have the Blackest Night Batman hanging out and the Batwing. So I'm going to put this back. That's a, that's a really nice Superman, actually. But I don't know. I don't really think I need it. And I can probably find it at my Target. I'm just grabbing those because, like I said, I don't know if I'll get to see them at mine. So why not? And then coming on down, it's pretty much the same that we've seen at any other Target. The Necrons hanging out, the Calabac, and Blue Beetle. So it figures no Killer Croc, bro. Check this out. Adam Cole, Bay Bay, 1099 clearance. 1099 clearance. And the A dubs are buy one, get one half off. Sweet. Figure I grab, this one's got some wear, but I figure I grab two of them. Sweet. For you know who who's looking for it. Um, look, they got your buddy Miguel up here for $13.99 on clearance. Miguel? Yeah, from Cobra Kai. The Super 7 Beast Wars figures are out. But this Megatron is beautiful. Um, I just, the, the translucent, like, purple on him, I, I'm really digging that. Megatron, we have Optimus Primal. I love these, the card arts too. Like, you have the red, the blue, the purple. This looks really, really nice. Cheetor. I think Cheetor is the one I, I saw the last time I went to my Target. Um, this is the only one that they had. He does look pretty friggin' nice, though. And we got my other boy, Dinobot. This looks really good. His face doesn't look all that bad. I like this one a lot, actually. Whoa, what are you trying to do? Uh -huh. Trying to get rock bottom right here in the middle of Target? <laughs> I'm just kidding. And some Rise of the Beasts figures. And I think that's gonna do it for this aisle. So we will keep looking. This is pretty cool. We'll keep looking and see if we can find anything else. I wonder if they have a clearance aisle here. So the wife found something she's been looking for. She's been kind of getting into this um the Skultimate um monster high dolls oh they do have her that's not the right one though right no you're not looking for fear your de your um, the descent is that how you say I that i mean it doesn't really matter I'm stupid i can't read fear descent fear descent that's what i thought it was i just i mean i don't really mind it that's not the one you wanted though no no don't get it just because it's there i, I mean if it's not the one you wanted but they only have one of her but yeah so she's looking for uh what's her name cleo denial because she likes a lot of stuff that's pertaining to Egypt, to ancient Egypt. Um, so I, not this particular one, but the other one that came out that's not Fearadescent is the one that she's looking for, um, for Cleo Denial. So we'll, we'll see if we can find her. Um, and if not, we'll probably head out. I mean, I don't really see anything else here. We might check to see if there's clearance. Um, other than that, that might be it. It's been so long since I've gone to a Target that I almost forgot that they have NECA. How the hell can you forget that? So, let's go find that section and let's see if there's anything there that we can pick up. And if not, we're probably gonna end the video. So, off to NECA we go. Here it is, I'm starting to think they didn't have a section for this because it's not where it normally is. 
Um, so far nothing. What's this right here? American Werewolf in London figure. Victor Crowley. No other Toonie Terrors. I know some of them, some new ones came out recently. But none of those that uh, we need. Well, your pops, we don't care about pops. And then I guess this is the rest of the NECA section. Not really much of a section, but... Uh-oh. I finally found you. And I wish... I wish those were the prices for it. Damn, I finally found the Ryu. I've been looking for this. The times I did go to Target, at least. I haven't really uh, been hunting too hard. Damn, the box, man. This is this is really nice, the way this is set up. He looks amazing. And they have several of them. Same with Fei Long. I don't know. I'll probably... I want to get it. But again, if I just keep hunting my targets, I'll find it. You know, like I'm down on vacation. I don't really need the toys I can get back at home, you know. But it is it is tempting. Another uh, Ultimate Freddy. It's pretty cool. Take him down so you guys can see. The little snow effect in the corner. That's awesome. Goes throughout the box. Yeah, it's from the end of the movie. I can remember. That's cool, I honestly didn't know that was coming out. Cause like I said, I really haven't been paying attention to a lot of the newer stuff. So, but what is this? That's, it must be these ones that are finally on clearance for $11.99. It's about time. I think that's gonna do it for the video. Some clearance pops, $14.99. So we will walk around again look at some other things, make sure we've made our decisions on what we're gonna get. And we will probably wrap up the video. We're getting ready to check out. I'm probably just gonna go with the Adam Cole. But one thing that I did notice, and you probably saw it in the video, was the sale for these actually ended on September 16th. Still gonna see if I can get both of these. If not, I'm still gonna get one. Um, so stay tuned to the very, very, very end. And uh, we will see if we end up getting both of them or not. So that's going to do it for this quick target hunt. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave some likes and comments down below. Um, felt pretty good to get back out and hunt at Target. Found some things that I was looking for. But like I said, there's no point in getting them because I'm on vacation. Yeah. Spend my money on stuff I can get back at home. Mm -hmm. um, the Adam Coles were an exception because it was a pain to find Sammy Guevara. And like I said, I never found the Darby Allen. So I don't want to risk not getting the Adam Cole. I wasn't really looking for this figure, but for $10, I mean, whatever. I'll put him on the shelf. and he'll, Yeah, exactly. He'll look good with the other figures. If you guys enjoy toy hunting videos and toy show videos, consider subscribing to the channel and turn on notifications so you never miss an upload. And like always... Thanks for watching, guys. I gotta go get me some pool action. Yeah, I'm going to the pool.